Hello and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We are here on Beam NG taking a look at the new drifting physics that somebody said was up in the game and the way the wheel feels. So we're gonna take a look at that today. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. All that you found in the description box below. Let's get to it. So we are in the 200 VX from Beam NG, the factory car. We are a, a track that I did download, so I'm gonna show you where to get that real quick. It is in the actual, if you just do download more, we are at Okingawa, and it is definitely a fun looking track. I believe I've driven this track in a set of courses. So we're gonna go full send today. We do not have a handbrake. Unfortunately, I don't have my pedal separated so the handbrake doesn't work. It would pretend to be clutch simultaneously. Every time I hit the clutch, it would want to hit the handbrake. So I'd have to separate my pedals from my base and USB. It's you know by itself so if you guys want to keep seeing beam ng here on the channel i may actually separate that so we're gonna try and just do some clutch kicks and see how this feels oh as we go already trying to rip the bumper off so beam ng was definitely a game i was very excited to get and uh, have drifting in because of damage and uh for first impressions i keep going for the handbrake of the way the wheel feels from what i was used to to what it is now we can get a full drift in here. Oh, doctor. Nope. It's not an easy game. Beam and G is not an easy game to drift in. But we got it there. That was a pretty smooth transition. Picked up in the third. All right. So, actually feels pretty good. Way better than it used to. So we're going to try and, I wish I had a handbrake, we may have to uh, do another episode with a handbrake. I do have some modded cars, we are just running the Beam NG car, we're going to go this way. That comes with the game so anybody can actually just hop in this car and drive and, oh don't hit the sign, I can't see where I'm at, <laughs> and have fun with it. So it is very, very different than what it was which is very good that it's and you know once you get the feel of it it's actually quite good oh but definitely a handbrake would help so we're gonna have to get our handbrake going in the next episode and it's just because my Fanatec all my pedals and everything are wired into the base so the game does not recognize the handbrake separate from the clutch pedal so if I separate the pedals from my base and make it its own USB port then it will recognize it because I have had a handbrake in here before so we definitely need to get the handbrake here to make this fully oh hmm well we just ripped our front bumper off so we'll probably broke something in the front. Even cheat definitely the best when it comes to damage. But yeah, we're a little bit hurting. Nope, go this way. It's look like it look I'm look like I'm a brand new drifter at, you know, a amateur event right now trying to do this. It's definitely not easy. If you guys do have BeamNG and you have some good places to get mods for cars, let me know down in the comment section down below because I very like to get some other mods in this game. I thought we could get saucy with that, but unfortunately could not. So let's go see what other cars I do have that we might be able to drift. Because I know we do... Well, I just stalled the car. We do have a Corolla, so we'll pull out the Drift Corolla, because why not, once it decides to spawn in. Alright, so we have the Drift Corolla out now. We'll see how this thing feels. We are going backwards, I believe, so... Oh, okay. Uh, well, we have a blown front tire. So we're gonna have to 
respawn this car because unfortunately we already wrecked it into pits. So let's respawn a new Corolla, fix our tire. We're going to go into this little pit area first to see if we can't get a minute of shakedown with the car. Alright, I think we... I think we got this. I say that as we're probably going to go full send into the walls. Luckily there's not too many walls to hit here on this track. I keep wanting to grab the handbrake but it's not there. Don't know what's going on with the front tire. My game did migrate to a, leave a newer thing and some of the mods I had did not actually come over correctly. Not doing too bad. Like I said, BMNG, not an easy game. So if you guys have it, let me know if, what mods you guys are using in the game because I only have a few, but I plan on doing a lot more BMNG here in the future. I feel like we almost just got a full lap with this car. Oh, as I say that, we're about to go into the wall. Alright, full send on this first turn. Oh, that's bad. Jeez. Uh, kind of broke our window and uh, broke some stuff. Let's see if I can find how to change. I'm trying to figure out how to change views here. Nope, that's not what I wanted. And apparently, I don't want my turn signal on, but apparently the game is trying to tell me. Oh, I just did the out of car well <laughs> we, we kind of broke our Corolla so we're gonna have to spawn another one but we're gonna spawn a different version so we just decided to spawn back in to get rid of that turn signal so I really wish the 180s would actually be working correctly but unfortunately the like I said the textures when I migrated over as you can see do not look the greatest so the car does not really work, and this is a grip car. The car pictures for the taillights and things of that nature don't work, but we are just going to get a drift one in the game, and we're going to go full send on it and see if maybe we can go drifting in the 180, you know, regardless of texture issues. Pull out the drift pig. Let's see what we can do. Oh, definitely not as much steering angle as the other cars. Nope. Nowhere near the steering angle I need. So if you guys have some good beam and G mods, let me know down in the comment section what they are. Because I'd be very interested to get some new ones. Handbrake doesn't work because obviously I do not have that many. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode. A little look at BMNG, more coming to the channel. BMNG Drive, definitely a fun game with damage. And we're just gonna go full send with this car probably into a wall because you guys didn't just come here for drifting. You guys came here for damage and things too. <laughs> I think that'll do it for this episode here. I'll be BMNG. Should you guys follow me on all social media? This car's really broke. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. See you guys on the track.